The importance of standardization is not related to our modern era, but a translation of human needs since old ages of time. Thus, the correlation between humans and standardization indicates that the standardization is considered at the core of life. It achieves justice, enforces rights, removes oppression, and avoids adulteration because it provides a well-arranged system and simplified operations to undergo complicated activities, which is a reason to reach an understanding and recognition of the perfect and active methods in work and production. The government perception of the importance of standardization is upgrading services, improving production operations, and protecting consumers and national economy brought up the decision for the establishment of the SSMO as a scientific, supervisory, and precautional organization on basis of the following constitutional resolutions. The Ministry of the Cabinet Resolution No. 287 for the year 1992. The presidential degree issued in September in 1992. The National Assembly Resolution No. 68 for the year 1993, which successively conjoins Ways and Measures Department together with the General Administration for Quality Control in the Ministries of Trade and Industry and creates the nucleus for the SSMO's birth. This was followed by the Presidential Decree No. 74 for the year 2002, which brings together all the state weights and measures offices with all their assets and manpower under the SSMO authority. The aims and objectives of the SSMO focalized on protection and improvement of national economy, protection consumer health and environment, connecting laboratories with quality assurance programs, developing and mobilizing national products from its original fields to the international markets to preserve its competition characteristics, engaging scientific research to promote production and development based on a standards specification, spreading awareness of standardization within the society and among the organizations of production and services, supplying investors and investment channels with the international trade requirements, the SSMO policy based on rooting and infusing the conception of quality to be adopted as a philosophy by the government and the public and private institutions, issuing a large number of standards specification to promote development, issuing and adopting quality guidelines and technical regulations, the horizontal and vertical expansion of inspection, testing and analysis for all commodities by using advanced specialized methods to cope with the technological development, adopting the standards of the regional and international organizations which play an important role in the international trade. The SSMO functions under the umbrella of the Ministry of the Cabinet. The subordination imparts a distinguished sovereign position for the SSMO and provides a close follow-up and auspices by the country supervisor command, which puts consumer protection in the top of its priorities. The SSMO manages its affair and provides services through the upper administration, which is represented by the Board of Directors, includes a group of scientists, expertise and upper-class officials, in addition to the SSMO Director General, who is managing the work through accurate procedures with integrated roles in the headquarters and states. The administration of a standard specification includes Standards Specification Department, Technical Committees Department, Library and Information Center. The Technical Administration includes Supervision and Inspection Department includes Quality Assurance Unit, Conformity and Quality Mark, Follow-up Section, Exports and Imports Unit, Samples Deliverance and Engineering Unit. Laboratories Department includes aflatoxins, cereals, paints, chromatography, diary products, 
microbiology, dumps products, and construction materials, oils, textiles, minor salts and water, chemistry, cement, environment, cosmetics, and pharmaceutical inputs, dried batteries, electrical and electronic, pesticide residue, and children's toys. The administration of metrology and calibration includes hallmarking departments includes testing units, coffers and receiving samples, samples deliverance and hallmarking units. Metrology and calibration department includes calibration lab, maintenance and reforming atelier of weights role, Metrology Science Center, State's Metrological Offices. The Administrative and Financial Administration, which supports the above-mentioned technical administrations in headquarters and state branches. SSMO State's Branches. The SSMO expands through the whole country via 18 branches and 27 metrological offices. Major Achievements Standards Specification Field The SSMO taking advantage of the specialized national expertise from universities and research centers in public and private sectors in preparing standards specification achieved 3,066 SDS including adopted standards as well as seven technical guides for pesticide, national expertise, technical committees, standards specification, live animals, water tanks and medicinal and aromatic plants, in addition to establishing a number of national committees to enhance technical activities and develop related standardization research and coordinating standards specification to improve the competitive characteristics of the national products. Metrology and Calibration Field The SSMO activities expanded horizontally to cover all the states and vertically in the field of lab lotteries by importing modern and upgraded equipment. On the other hand, the Metrology and Calibration Science Center aimed at qualifying personnel to obtain the diploma degree in metrology by calibration, one of the rare technical qualifications with the capacity to include African and Arabic personnel as stated in the bilateral agreement signed between the SSMO and other regional counter-organizations. Field of Technical Activities The SSMO set up and rehabilitated a number of laboratories in the center and the states to facilitate controlling supervision and ensuring exports and imports commodities. The SSMO, by enhancing local production, aims at increasing its competitive characteristics through quality control, providing information and technical assistance for the production sectors to improve quality of products and reduce its loss. The SSMO executes a periodical inspection campaign to markets by the National Committee to rid the markets of non-complying commodities which includes related supervisory institutions to protect the consumer against deteriorated commodities. The SSMO also set up a number of research centers for contamination measures, gum arabic and aflatoxins. The following curve relieves the number of conformity certificates issued by the SSMO for export and imports during the period 
In order to facilitate the movement of trade and control commodities supervision, the SSMO accredited a number of international surveying companies according to their experiences and technical capacity in such fields. The SSMO made the maximum use of all media and press facilities to spread standardization culture and increase the awareness of consumers, producers and services providers through engaged artistic and creative models to address consumer sectors. The SSMO obtained full membership of the following international organizations. International Organization for Standardization Codex Alimentarius Commission Arab Industrial Development and Mining Organization International Association for Surreal Science and Technology The African Regional Organization for Standardization The Islamic Institute for Standardization in Turkey In addition, the SSMO is considered at the focal point for the WTO agreements in the field of sanitary and phytosanitary measures and technical barrier to trade in the Sudan. The SSMO enjoys close contacts with the International Electrotechnical Commission, being an affiliate member, the European Standardization Commission, and recently a correspondent member of the International Organization for Legal Metrology and other related organizations. The SSMO has also signed a number of bilateral agreements in the field of standardization with various regional and international counter-organizations for standardization. In accordance with the Peak and Stability Treaty with the Southern Sudan, the SSMO rehabilitated new offices and branches in the Southern States to protect consumers and enhance the national economy. The SSMO remain working so hard to upgrade the level of harmonization and cooperation between relevant organizations in local and international levels to serve consumers and the national economy.